Let's take a look at the differential form of conservation of mass, um, which is also called the continuity equation, and see how that can be written in terms of the Reynolds average velocities. The continuity equation is that, as we've seen before, written in the uh, 2D Cartesian coordinates, x and y. And this applies to the um, the fluctuating velocity, okay, so um, that's uh, fluctuating velocity and that also is fluctuating crazily. And we want to write this now in terms of the, the Reynolds average. That's where we are going. And recall that, you know, the velocity is decomposed into the Reynolds average plus a fluctuation. And you can average this equation. Um, and so here you will just get u bar when you average that term. And the average of the average is just average, so you'll get u bar again. And here you'll get the average of the fluctuations. And I can knock off this and this, which means that the average of the fluctuations um, in the u velocity is zero. Similarly, the average of the fluctuations in the v velocity is zero. Now, if I substitute this in here and also the corresponding you know, Reynolds decomposition for the v-velocity, and then I average the equations, what happens is all the fluctuating quantities will drop out because of this, um, this you know, because the average of the fluctuations is zero. And the Reynolds average continuity will look like that, which is the same as the original continuity equation. So c since continuity is linear for incompressible flows, um, the Reynolds average version of continuity is the same as the original continuity equation. We'll see that this is not the case for the conservation of momentum equation.